Hello friends, welcome to Civil Engineering Exam. Today we are going to see the problem related with the strength of materials. So the question is, a beam 7 meter long supported at the left end and 6 meter from the left end. Respectively, if the carry is a point load of 30 kN, 20 kN and 10 kN from uh, 2 meter, 4 meter and 7 meter from the left end respectively. Draw the bending moment and see a force diagram. Okay, so first we have to draw the beam. So the totally 7 meter beam. Okay, so the support is left end. So this is left end and 6 meter from the left end. Okay, so from the 6 meter from left end we have one support. Okay, so here since this is the overhanging beam. Okay, so the support is uh, away from the end. So now uh, the point load is 30 kN is 2 meter from left end. So that is 30 kN is a point load. So the second thing is 4 meter 20 kN. Sorry, third thing is 7 meter 7 meter certain kN. Okay, so this is 2 meter, this is also 2 meter, here is 1 meter. Okay, so now we can uh, find out the uh, shear force and bending moment diagram using RA and RB. So reactions we have to find out RA and RB. So now solution, first reactions, sum of upward forces equal to sum of downward forces. So RA plus RB sum of upward forces equal to downward forces is 30 plus 20 plus 10. So now Ra plus Rb equal to that is 60. Okay. So now we can take the moment about uh, B. So we can take the moment about B. So now Ra into 6 meter. So that is positive force. So then again minus 30 into so the distance will be uh, 4 4 again minus 20 into 2 meter again this is positive force plus 10 into 1 meter equal to 0 so now 6 r a equal to this come in, the, in this side so that is 150. So now R A equal to 150 divided by 6 equal to 25 kN. Okay, so now R A equal to 25 kN. We can substitute the values over here. R B equal to 35 kN. So now R A is 25 kN. R B equal to 35 kN. Okay, so using this we can uh, draw the shear force and bending moment diagram. Now we can find out the shear force. So from here A, this is B. So from K, at left side there is no forces and right side we have the 25 kN. Uh, this is positive force, so 25 kN. So then uh, there is no forces between uh, in this 30 kN point. So this is maintained for 30 kN. After that uh, take this side is anti-clockwise. So minus 30. So again 25 minus 30 is minus 5. Okay. So up to here same 25 is maintained. After that again uh, it having the anti-clockwise force the 20. So already we have minus 5 and again minus 20 that is minus 25. Minus 25. Okay. So still over here, here also 35. So between A left side there is a forces minus 25. After that we can take uh, B at right side. We have the positive direction that is clockwise force of 35. So minus 25 plus 35 we have 10. Okay. So now it's maintained 
at the up to left end sorry right end so uh, here in the right end so left side the maintained at the 10 and after that right side we have the anti clockwise force of 10 so we we have minus 10 positive 10 minus 10 equal to 0 okay so this is the shear force diagram this is positive here also positive this is negative okay so next thing is bending moment calculation bending moment diagram so now bending moment at a so bending moment at a will be zero okay so then bending moment at this we can take this is c and this is d and this is e okay bending moment at c we have the only force of 25 into 2 meter so that is 50 kilonewton meter so this is clockwise force then bending moment at d we have same 25 kilonewton for the RA into 4 meter okay so the distance will be 4 again minus 30 into 2 meter because force into distance so now we got the value of 40 kilonewton meter okay so then bending moment at b again we have the uh, force of 25 into there is 6 meter distance minus 30 into 4 meter distance here so from the b it will be the force will be 4 meter away from the b support then minus again we having the anti clockwise 20 kilonewton force so point load 20 into 2 okay solving this we got the value of uh, minus 10 kilonewton meter okay so next thing is uh, bending moment at end at e so again we have 25 into 7 minus the 30 into 5 minus 20 into 3 again we have the positive force plus 35 into 1 okay so solving this we got the value of 0 okay so we can draw the bending moment diagram so now here will be 0 then positive 50 then after that positive 40 these are all the straight lines because uh, if the UDL is there we can uh, draw it's a parabolic so now here so only point load we can uh, draw the straight lines so then at B it having the minus 10 so then 0 okay so here is 50 kilonewton meter so here 40 here 10 kilonewton meter so this is a positive this is negative so this is a method we can solve the problem so we can find out the sfd and bmd so again we will see in next video. Thank you.